I worked too fucking hard for this to lose interest, you know? Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and to be honest, I'm so fucking happy to be back from the lake and just back in my freaking zone. Not gonna lie, I have a massive headache and my upload time is an hour ago, so I'm sorry for the late upload, but if you came here to watch my video, I fucking appreciate you more than you'll ever know. But on the way home from the lake, I wrote down a bunch of video ideas, so this week will honestly be one of the best weeks on YouTube for me when it comes to content, so beware for that. And with the recent growth here on my channel, I feel like you all deserve that for getting me to where I am today. So thank you so fucking much. And if you couldn't tell with the way I'm talking and acting, I'm just so excited and just thankful for everything that I've gained over the last few days. So without further ado, let's get on with the video, guys. Hopefully you had a good weekend and yeah, welcome back to another video. Okay, in the comments below, because I know you guys like to play Call of Duty, obviously, which attachments are the best for the VMP? If you have a certain preference, leave that in the comments below. I'm genuinely curious because I don't fucking know. You guys know this shit. I'm not very good with my attachment selection. So if you have any recommendations, please put them in the comments below. What I want to talk to you guys about is the weekend. I know I've been talking a lot about the weekend and just boring shit like that. But for some reason, this is a topic idea that I really wanted to talk about for some reason. I'm not sure why, but it's happening. So if you didn't know, I work a full-time job. I've had a lot of new subscribers come in within the last few days, and I feel like there's a lot of stuff that I'm gonna need to repeat over the next few days for a lot of the new people to kind of understand who I am just a little bit better. And way back when, my off days were YouTube videos. My off days were to grind YouTube, make videos, stack videos for the upcoming weeks, and that's just how you know what my weeks were that's how they were spent and i do not do youtube as a full-time anything youtube to me will forever and always be a hobby no matter how big i get i will treat it the same as a full-time job but it won't be like it'll forever be a hobby so i will continue to enjoy it for as long as i live i'll never consider it a job so that i'll just never lose interest because as soon as you call something a job i feel like that's when people start to lose interest and i never want to happen that to happen when it comes to youtube i work too fucking hard for this to lose interest you know i'm just that kind of person so i do have a job full-time job i work as a receptionist i've told people this a million times but like i said new subscribers a lot of people won't know who i am and you know what i'm all about so feel like I need to explain this again. During high school, I used to grind videos on the weekends. That's what I used to do. I used to stay up till five in the morning making videos, doing shit like that. On weekdays, school days, I still used to stay up really stupidly late, but for the most part, weekends were my YouTube video grind days. Like that's when I just went off with video making. Oh shit. But now that I'm working a full-time job, weekends are just days that I just want to get as far away from the internet as I possibly can. Not because I don't like the internet, but because I work so hard during the week to do what I do and I absolutely love it. But I feel to not get burnt out every weekend, I need to take a step back and I need to enjoy what is around me for what it is. And since I treat the weekends like that, I feel like YouTube is that much more special to me, you know? I take my two days away, Saturday, Sunday, and you know, I just embrace life for what it is. Like, you know, it's a beautiful thing. Like, that sounds really fucking cheesy. But the more you stay cooped up and you make the internet something that you do day to day, you know, it gets to be stale. And if you grind that out for as long as you can, as hard as you can, because that's something you really want, no matter how bad you want it, it's gonna get stale. So. Weekends for me are my off days, like I said. And that's when I take my steps back. And here's the issue with that. I feel like these down days go by so freaking fast, it's like you blink and they're gone. There's nothing wrong with that in the end because getting back to the grind is honestly the best feeling after you took your two days off. You know, you're refreshed, you're feeling good. Sitting down and making a video and just going to town on what you do day to day feels amazing after those two down days. And since I work full time, it's not like I have a school summer where I have two months off and don't get to do anything and I can just chill, be lazy. No, I get two days a week, which is more than a lot of other people, but I get two days a week and you know, I just 
you know, I sit back, I chill, I relax, and it's gone within a snap of a finger, and I'm back to the grind again. Well, I don't know where I'm going with this topic, but I just feel like the weekends go super duper fast, and when you're a kid and you're in school, you just don't appreciate that as much, like having weekends and like summers and that time off. And then when you work for a living and stuff like that, it's just, you learn how to work around life and appreciate it a little bit more. See, I don't know where I'm going with this fucking topic. I really don't. It could be a lot of nonsense to a lot of you guys, but a lot of my videos, as you guys will come to realize, are a bunch of fucking nonsense. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one, which will be tomorrow. Hopefully my K-Days video, but again, at the end of this video, I just want to say thank you guys. You have been so good to me recently, and it's making me one of the happiest people alive, and I'm genuinely really happy to be doing what I do on YouTube, and it's literally thanks to you guys that i can sit in my chair and be this happy making youtube videos and i just appreciate that so much so thank you guys from the bottom of my heart like just thank you and i'll see you tomorrow